My sick daughter is my own issue. Your problems, they affect other people, and I am allowed to be upset about the things that you do. So I'm, I'm not the go home with a guy from the bar kind of gal. No, no. I'm more of a loner. Me too. Mmm, that's amazing. Straight from the Isle of Novina, Russia. <laughs> Uh, who knew that Russians made such good cheese, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I only went to the bar tonight because I wanted to see if I could still do it. Usually I'm just sitting home watching all my victims die. Uh, what? All my victims die. It's a new series on Netflix. Oh. It is riveting. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I guess what I'm trying to say is that you surprised me tonight. I did? Yeah. In a, in a good way, in a good way. <laughs> I, I hope I'm not, you know, freaking you out at all. I like you, Mr. Tom. Do you have any Zofran or anything like that? These new antidepressants are making me so nauseous. Uh, yeah, I should check the cabinet right behind you. What are you taking? Zoloft? That one made me nauseous too. What are you taking now? I take one juice bar in the morning and one at night with Lexapro. You're taking three anxiety pills a day? You really should talk to your psychiatrist about Xanax. It's made a huge difference for me. Well, they won't prescribe me any benzodiazepines because of a family history of addiction. But if you really need it, they should give it to you. Look, smoking's bad, coke is bad, it's all bad. Yeah, it's all bad, but of course yours is worse, right? What does that mean? Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. I no, actually, I what wanna... do you mean? Okay, fine. Well, it's like anytime I do anything or I say anything or I think anything or anything happens to me, of course you've experienced that, but 10 times worse, right? I'm sorry. I'm just trying to help you avoid the mistakes that I've made. Okay, so you turn it into one giant dick measuring contest of who's more fucked up than the other? It's like, no wonder I turned out like this. Well, I guess I'm just a terrible mother. So, Mr. Tom, mm -hmm. do you mind if I ask you what you do for a living? I mean, most guys just want to talk about their job all the time, and you've been, you know, talking about me a lot, so... Look, baby, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to help. I've never felt anything like that in my entire life.